it is a tremendous honor to, to serve the Ohio Valley Conference as a member of the, uh, of the football committee. Uh, certainly, it's even a tremendous honor when your national peers elect you to be chair this year. But it's really helped me become more educated on football and, uh, and the decisions that we even make at, at Tennessee Tech and to, and to lead uh, FCS football uh, because it's very important to our institutions that sponsor football. And it's, it's, uh, I've watched a lot of games, watched more games this year than I've ever watched in my life because it's a tremendous responsibility to make sure that we get the very best at-large teams to participate in this year's championship. FCS is very important to Division I because it gives institutions like members of the Ohio Valley Conference uh, an option to play football that don't may, may not want to play at the bowl subdivision level and make that financial commitment, you know, to football. Uh, and football is very, very important to the United States. It's a great sport, and, and, and I'm happy that Division One sponsors, you know, FCS football. The expansion of the FCS bracket has been tremendous and well-received. It's been a goal of you know, FCS football coaches and directors of athletics for a long period of time because after you take the automatic qualifiers, you know, the at-large pool was really pretty tight. And now with that at-large pool selected, it gives more teams an opportunity to compete in, in postseason. And, and for all of us that, that sponsor FCS football, that's a goal of ours, make it to the postseason, make it to the NCAA as an opportunity to win a, a, a national championship. And we've had a great relationship with Frisco for the first five years that, uh, that we've been there. Looking forward to that continuing for a, a long period of time. Uh, it's, it's really helped to, you know, build the FCS brand. I think uh, last year with the creation of the college football playoff, I thought that led to credibility for the FCS playoffs because we've been determining our national champion through a playoff system for a long period of time. And I think with uh, you know, the bowl subdivision teams moving to the college football playoff, I thought that really led to great credibility for us. It was excellent last year for their first college football playoff to be in Arlington and, and we are in Frisco. So I thought there was great synergies be between both national championships. The NCAA broadcast partner for FCS football is ESPN. So all games are on one of the ESPN families of networks, whether that be ESPN, ESPN2, ESPNU, or ESPN3. So, hey, for all FCS fans, that's the place to go during the, the uh, Division I football championships for FCS football. I think all of the Ohio Valley Conference institutions have made a strong commitment to, to football and really looking to improve in football and to win an Ohio Valley Conference championship and, and to be pertinent on the national scene. And I think we have seen that with Eastern Illinois and then this year with, with Jacksonville State, you know, the, the, the commitments in those runs. And now we need some teams to make some deep runs into, into the playoffs. And some of that is, is being prepared for those opponents, so how we schedule our non-conference opponents. And I mean, that prepares us for a good seed and to be, you know, be selected as an at-large based on the strength of our schedule. Uh, so we, we as directors of athletics need to be smart in, in how we help our football coaches you know, schedule uh, who they're playing. And then we really need a team to go deep into the playoffs. And we'll see what uh, you know, the teams that are in this year. You know, Jacksonville State is certainly probably a team that's, that's going to be in and has the potential to make a deep run. And, and for, for the Ohio Valley Conference, you know, we all hope that, that they do that. Because once it gets to the playoffs, you know, it's, it's not about you know, Tennessee Tech. It's about cheering for your, your, your OVC teams. Sure. It is a tremendous honor to, to serve the Ohio Valley Conference as a member of the, uh, of the football committee. Uh, certainly, it's even a tremendous honor when your national peers elect you to be chair this year. But it's really helped me become more educated on football and, uh, and the decisions that we even make at, at Tennessee Tech and, and to lead uh, FCS football uh, because it's very important to our institutions that sponsor football. And it's, it's, uh, I've watched a lot of games, watched more games this year than I've ever watched in my life because it's a tremendous responsibility to make sure that we get the very best at-large teams to participate in this year's championship.